Today, I just wanted to do a quick review uh, KNF concept. They sent me this uh, Nano Series filter kit, which is a magnetic kit. Um, I also got set. I also got sent some uh, step up rings and some step down rings, uh, which I reckon are very useful to have, especially if. Uh, what I've done, I've ordered the 80, is it 82 mil? Uh, the big one, so, uh, you know, if I ever had an 82 mil lens, then I'd go from 82 all the way down to something like this, which I think is a 62 mil. So if I wanted to do any long exposures, um, I can put a ring on this from 62 mil up to 88, so it allows me to use these so yeah uh these step rings are really useful so let's have a look at this little kit now i've used the uh, nano filters by KNF in the past and i have to say they are good uh, i don't get any color cast from it at all now they come in a little pouch like this um, you get a ring which you put on the uh, on the actual lens, uh, which is magnetic. Um, what is this? You also get a um, 10 stop Nano X magnetic filter. That's a 10 stop filter. Uh, like I said before, I've done tests on these filters and they are, they are good. Um, then you get yeah that's the polarizer and you get a uv um piece of glass here i never use these things um so i know some people do i don't i never use them so that'll probably come from there now what i hope knf will do in the future is make more uh of these magnetic um, filters it would be nice if they made a three stop and a six stop uh oops yeah it'd be nice if we made a three stop and a six stop uh to add to this bag uh it'd be good so every time i was going out to do anything with rivers i didn't really include the sky this would be my bag uh just a nice addition to have so you'd open it up you'd have your ring you'd have your polarizer your 10 your six and your three stop um that would be good but personally i don't use these uv ones at all so yeah comes in a nice little bag um it's got room in the back here you can put it attach it to your belt uh which is probably really useful actually uh or your camera bag somewhere so yeah nice um nice little uh kit over here and like i said um this is these are your step down rings and your step up rings always it's always good to have a set of these anyway so uh, and they're only about 18 pounds if if that so well worth having um i think this kit is something like 90 pounds not too sure you'd have to have a look on the uh, link below so right then i'm just going to show you how it actually works so first of all, I'm going to need this step up ring here, which is the uh, 77 to 82 mil step up ring. I'm going to attach that onto the uh, lens. Now, what I need to do 
is to attach the magnetic ring onto that. Now this should just screw onto that, just like that. And then I'm just gonna put this UV one on, just for now. That should just, that's it. It just fits on like that. No fuss, straight on and you've got that nice free movement too, so. So if you are interested in these uh, KNF magnetic filters, um, I'll leave a link below to the filters and uh, the step up and step down rings, uh, which are re really useful to have. So uh, I'll leave them in the link below. Hopefully I can get back to my vlogging very soon. Um, just had a lot of problems lately with the car. It's been an absolute pain in the ass. Uh, like you know, we had to remove the head gasket. It came back, it was okay for a week. Then I had to go back in to uh, replace a turbo. That didn't solve the problem. Um, replace the coil pack, that didn't solve the problem. And uh, now they're having a look at the pistons and the manifold. So uh, yeah, so it's been away for about a month anyway. Hopefully, if I'm lucky and I haven't buggered the car up, uh, things should get back to uh, normal next week. Now I can go out and do a bit of local photography, but um, I'm a bit fed up of doing that at the moment and there's only so much of that you can do. So uh, hopefully things will be back to normal again next week sometime. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And uh, like I said, I'll leave the link below uh, for these. Also, if you're interested in my uh, next year's calendar uh, there'll be a link below for that which is 16 pounds 99 uh, so yeah if you're interested in the calendar i'll leave a link below so uh, thanks for watching bye Right then, um, my 2022 calendar. Now, um, like I've said before, I thought last year I did, it was at the A3 size, it's just huge. And uh, it was costing a bomb just to uh, send them everywhere, especially sending them abroad. It was probably about 12 pound in postage, which was expensive. So what I've done this year is um, I've kept the uh, calendar pretty small so you're getting a nice you know big image if you ever want to frame them um also this year i'm putting a you got the main picture here of the lone tree and in the corner i got a different sort of image of the lone tree so something different this year and uh yeah this is just a test calendar i've changed some uh 
images I'll show you a little show reel of the uh, what you're gonna get image wise so yeah so that's what I've done this year uh, kept it a4 size uh, easy to uh, get, uh, send because this will just fit through the letter box nicely but I've tried to keep the image as a uh, as large as I can so if you're interested in the uh, 2022 calendar um, it's 16 pounds for these uh, that includes uh, delivery and shipping now if you live anywhere in Europe or America or Canada um, it's gonna cost 22 pounds for well including delivery with this so um, yeah um, I'm only printing 50 this year um, just don't want the hassle anyway but if you're interested in the calendar uh, UK price is 16 pounds um, just message me uh, to Jason Jones photo at outlook.com and I'll give you the uh, instructions of how to pay I'll leave the link below anyway so uh, that's it just an update really that the calendar is ready now for pre-order only 50 available I'm not doing any more than that so uh, if you want it uh, just uh, let me know and I'll uh, give you the details so that's it for now uh, just a channel update about the uh, problems we've had lately and uh, the calendar so uh, yeah thanks for watching uh, and until next time cheerio Thank you.